I'm Anastasia from Tech City News and I'm back with your Week in Tech. Another elevator pitch startup is making its mark this week as London-based Glow raised an incredible $7 million in investment. The advertising platform helps businesses make the most out of social media. Sports app Fan Mode scooped up a $2.5 million investment and local delivery service Gin hit the news also, raising $200,000 in investment to ramp up operations. So if you fancy that Big Mac, but you're too lazy to go and get it, Jin will bring it for you. Forget HD, now it's all about high frame rate and ultra HD, trialled for the first time at the Commonwealth Games in Glasgow. These are just some of the many technologies the BBC is testing, including virtual reality with the Oculus Rift. Foodity make ads and content shoppable and personal across the web, on mobile and in store. Their technology powers commerce, rewards and advertising some of the world's biggest publishers, retailers and brands. They're hiring a bunch of new recruits, including developers and designers, so click below to see if any of the roles are suitable for you. Our next story is not a bad joke. A plumber turned YouTube celebrity Colin Furs is set to unleash a fart machine on France. So what we've got to do now, take it to Dover, point it towards France, turn it on and hope they can hear it. This isn't even his craziest stunt yet. Past inventions have included magnetic shoes to walk on the ceiling. <laughs> I'm walking Our download of the week is Blipper, and here's Stephen Shaw to tell you more. Blipper is the world's leading image recognition platform that augments the real world around us via your smartphone, tablet, or wearable technology. A visual browser that unlocks dynamic branding content in real time. And finally, with summer here, many of you might be considering a cheeky digital detox, and a national park is doing just that. Before you enter the park, you can lock your phone away in a tech crash. So it's time to get over the separation anxiety and roam free with the birds and the bees. This has been your Week in Tech. For more, check out Tech City News and follow us on Twitter.